안녕하십니까? 2015학년도 3월 고3 전국연합학력평가 영어영역 듣기 및 말하기 평가 안내방송입니다. 잠시 후 2015학년도 3월 고3 전국연합학력평가 3교시 영어영역 듣기 및 말하기 평가 방송을 시작하겠습니다. 수험생 여러분은 편안한 마음으로 방송에 귀를 기울여 주시고 방송 담당 선생님께서는 스피커의 음량을 알맞게 조절해 주십시오. 수험생 여러분은 답안을 작성하기 전에 반드시 답안지 왼쪽 해답란에 상명과 수험 번호를 정확하게 기입하고 표기하였는지 확인하시기 바랍니다. 듣기 및 말하기 평가 문제는 1번부터 17번까지입니다. 방송을 잘 듣고 문제지에 있는 다섯 개의 답지 중에서 맞는 답 하나만 골라 답안지의 해당란에 바르게 표기하십시오. 그러면 지금부터 3교시 영어 영역 듣기 및 말하기 평가를 시작하겠습니다. 1번부터 17번까지는 듣고 답하는 문제입니다. 1번부터 15번까지는 한 번만 들려주고 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 방송을 잘 듣고 답을 하기 바랍니다. 1번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. I heard you started volunteering at the animal shelter. Is that true? Yeah, I started last week. I really like animals. Do they want more help? 2번 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hey David, I decided to audition for the singing program Hidden Stars. Good for you. What are you going to sing in the audition? I have some songs in mind, but I'm not sure which one is best. 3번. 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. May I have your attention, please? This is Ben Jenkins, President of the Student Council. As you know, a special event is taking place to celebrate Teacher's Day next week. If you haven't written a thank you card to your teachers yet, please take time to do it. It's easy. Postcards are available in all the classrooms and in the student council office. Just take a postcard and write a note expressing gratitude to your teacher. When you're done, drop it in the box at the student council office. We'll take care of the delivery for you. Your small gesture will make your teachers happy. Thank you for listening. 4번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Jennifer, would you like to have some of these strawberries? Thank you, Grandpa. They look fresh. I got them from the greenhouse this morning. Wow, these strawberries are very sweet. Yes, greenhouse farming is really developing. Farmers like me can control various conditions while growing plants. Do you mean plants in greenhouses are relatively free from weather conditions? Yes, that's one of the basics of greenhouse farming. Grandpa, I wonder how you deal with pest problems. Oh, common field pests can't get into the greenhouse easily. Great. 
I guess greenhouse farming can lead to increased profits for farmers. Of course, we can sell various fruits and vegetables even in winter. I see. o b a 대화를 듣고. 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Ms. Lee, did you look over the contract? Yes, I did. I'd like to change two things in the initial plan. No problem. What are they? First of all, the initial plan was to replace the bathtub. But I want to remove it and set up a shower instead. All right, but there'll be an additional cost. That doesn't matter. Just let me know about it later. Okay. Then what's the next change? Originally, I wanted the doors to be painted white, but now I want them to be light green. Okay. I'll order the light green paint then. Perfect. I can't wait to see my house when it's all done. I'm sure that it'll look fantastic. By the way, When will you move everything out of the house? We're doing it tomorrow, so you can start working the day after. 6번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Honey, I'm finally done with the wallpaper drawing for Shelley's room. Great. Would you look at it? Then I'll email it to the store to have it printed. Sure. Let's see. I put sunglasses on the sun in the upper left. How do you like it? Looks great. And I like the elephant raising its trunk toward the branches. He's trying to grab the leaves. Oh, there are two owls on one of the branches. They're so cute, aren't they? Yes, and I love this monkey, too. I especially like the way he's hanging upside down by his tail. Here's the thing Shelly will like the most. As you know, she loves rabbits. Ah, that's why you drew a rabbit on the back of the giraffe. That's right. 7번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자를 위해 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Laura, how's it going with the preparation for your exhibition? I already had my paintings arranged in the gallery. It wasn't easy. I understand. What are these cookies and drinks for? They're for the visitors. I'll take them to the gallery. Are you going to play music throughout the exhibition as you did last time? Of course. I've already chosen the music for the exhibition. Great. It sounds like everything's done, right? Well, I need to take these two boxes of brochures to the gallery. I can do that for you. Really? Thank you. I'm happy to have a friend like you. It's my pleasure. 8번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 식료품 가게에 다시 가려는 이유를 고르시오. Cindy, I'm home. Honey, I'm in the kitchen. How's your leg? Are you okay? I'm okay. Thank you for picking up the groceries. I'm happy to help out. I bought everything on the list. Thanks. Please put it into the refrigerator. Okay. Cabbage, carrots, broccoli, and pork. That's it. Where are the sausages? Did you forget to buy them? No, I'm sure I got them. Oh no, where did they go? Are you sure you bought them? Yes, of course. Look, it's right here on the receipt. You did buy them. You must have dropped them somewhere. 
wait. I remember I left them on the checkout counter. I'll go get them right now. Kuban. Tewari to go. Namjaga Chibura Kumegul Kurushio. May I help you? Yes, please. I'd like to buy some muffins and an apple pie. How much are they? The muffins are two dollars each, and the apple pies are four dollars each. Two muffins and one apple pie, please. By the way, is this red toy train for sale? If it is, I'd like to get it. No, it's a gift for customers who spend ten dollars or more at our store. It looks like I need to buy some more stuff to get the train. What about our chocolate donuts? They're only two dollars each. No, thanks. I think I'll get something to drink instead. How much is a cappuccino? It's four dollars. Shall I add one cappuccino to your order? Yes, please. So I can get the train, right? You sure can. Thank you. Here's my card. 10번. 대화를 듣고 중고 서점에 관해 두 사람이 언급하지 않은 것을 고르시오. Tim, did you buy the textbook for Professor Smith's class? Yes, I got one at Tom's used bookstore. The book is as good as new. I paid only $15. Wow, that's only half the price of a new one. Where's the bookstore? It's right next to the post office on Oak Street. Oh, it's not so far from here. It's in a newly built three story building. The whole building is used as the bookstore. That's really big. I'll get my book there too. Do you know when it opens? It probably opens at 10 a.m., but call the bookstore first to make sure. Okay, I will. Thanks. Christine, don't forget to get a membership card there. Members get a 5% discount on every purchase. Really? Thanks for the tip. 11번. 오픈 아트 클래스에 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Hello. This is Ellen White, director of the Springfield Community Center. I'm happy to make a special announcement about our open art class. This upcoming event is specially designed to give you an opportunity to make your own artwork. This event is open to all residents in our neighborhood. There's no registration fee. There will be a lot of fun activities, such as painting, printing on t shirts, and making clay art. This class will be held at the community center from 6 to 9 p.m. on Friday, March 27th. Keep in mind that space is limited to 30 participants. Registration is available only online. For more information, please visit our website at www.springfieldcommunity.org. 12번. 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 주문할 유아용 변기를 고르시오. What are you looking at on the internet, honey? I'm looking for a potty chair for our daughter, Sylvia. Good. She needs to start toilet training soon. Did you find a good one? I've narrowed down the list to five. Take a look. Let me see. Let's leave out the bear shaped one. Sylvia doesn't like bears. Okay. The one with the backrest seems more comfortable. What do you think? I agree. It'll definitely help her sit up straight. And some of these chairs automatically play music when babies sit on them. Sounds interesting. I like that feature. It'll help Sylvia relax. All right. Let's choose one of these two. 
Which one do you think is better? Sylvia likes both puppies and kittens. How about taking the cheaper one? Perfect. Let's order it. Honey, what are these things on the table for? They're cake ingredients for Tony's birthday party tomorrow. Are you going to make his birthday cake yourself? Yes, I'll give it a try this time. Didn't you say that you'd buy one? I did. But I'm sure Tony will like it better if I make one myself. Of course he will, but you've never made a cake before. A few days ago, I happened to see a cooking program on TV. Do you mean Lisa's Kitchen? Yes, she was making a birthday cake. It looked easy. Well, it might not be as easy as it looks. 14번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Julie, how many books do you read a month? I read about two or three books. Wow, you're a big reader. How do you do that? I try to read for at least an hour a day. An hour a day? That would be impossible for me. I always have so much homework to do. And I'm busy playing sports. Alex, I have lots of things to do too, but I'm doing it. So, would you tell me how you make time for reading? First of all, as soon as I get home, I turn off my cell phone for at least one hour. You make time that way. That's a good idea. Next, I carry a book with me at all times. That's another good tip. It sounds easy. I'll try it. Finally, I make a list of books I'd like to read. When I'm finished with one book, I know what to read next. 15번 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 제인이 미스터 팬에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Jane has just transferred to Glen High School. She's extremely shy and has a hard time making new friends. One day, Jane's homeroom teacher, Mr. Penn, suggests going on a field trip with his history club members. Mr. Penn thinks that Jane will have a great chance to make new friends on the trip. Jane is reluctant at first, but she finally decides to go on the trip. During the trip, Jane gets close to some members of the club. Now she has her own friends. Jane wants to tell Mr. Penn how helpful the trip has been and how satisfied she is. In this situation, what would Jane most likely say to Mr. Penn? 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 16번부터 17번 다음을 듣고 물음에 답하시오. You put a tremendous amount of pressure on your feet every day. So you should give serious thought to the type of shoes you wear, especially while playing sports. Wearing the right shoes can help protect one's feet and ankles and guard against injury. Depending on the sport, varying amounts of pressure will be put on your feet. Thus, you need shoes that provide different types of support. For example, because you pound your feet while running, you need to look for shoes that have excellent heel support and extra cushioning to absorb the constant shock. Unlike running that repeats straight-ahead motions, tennis and aerobics require side-to-side -side movements. So you need special shoes that offer additional foot support for such movement. Lastly, 
Basketball demands extra stability and support when running and jumping on the court. That's why you have to wear basketball shoes on the court. All athletic shoes are not equal in their functions. I hope you wear the right shoes when playing sports. 다시 한번 듣겠습니다. You put a tremendous amount of pressure on your feet every day. So you should give serious thought to the type of shoes you wear, especially while playing sports. Wearing the right shoes can help protect one's feet and ankles and guard against injury. Depending on the sport, varying amounts of pressure will be put on your feet. Thus, you need shoes that provide different types of support. For example, because you pound your feet while running, you need to look for shoes that have excellent heel support and extra cushioning to absorb the constant shock. Unlike running that repeats straight-ahead motions, tennis and aerobics require side-to-side -side movements, so you need special shoes that offer additional foot support for such movement. Lastly, basketball demands extra stability and support when running and jumping on the court. That's why you have to wear basketball shoes on the court. All athletic shoes are not equal in their functions. I hope you wear the right shoes when playing sports. 16번 여자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은? Chipelbon. Unkup den Undongi Aningosen. Ide Tikimit Baragi Munjega Kunasnida. 